WCY.TV. David Brooks. Doty, thanks. We're, uh, see, this is for, you're going to put it up on your channel, right? On YouTube? Okay. So, David Brooks, call you painter? Yeah. Uh, so what we're out here doing is we're looking for roadblocks. Because people are saying that uh, citizens going down the road are being stopped, asking for ID, uh, prevented from, you know, traveling public roads. Oh, that's absolutely not true. This is the entrance to the Bundy Ranch. This is the only entrance that we monitor. The road going down through here, and completely clear. We don't do anything at all with the people except that it goes down through there, except for wave at them, and they all wave back, they smile. People around here are glad to see us. We absolutely do not block the road. That's a lie. I'm not even gonna talk about the details. It's just an absolute lie. The only part that we even bother with is a step over here to block the entrance to the Bundy Ranch. That's as far as we go, and it's always a pleasant interaction. We do not block the road. It's an absolute lie. Okay. How long have you been out here? This is my fourth day. Why'd you come? Because good men were asking for help, and they said they were tired. And it's hard for me to get on the bus and come all the way from Ohio, but I did. So you come to stand in the gap? I did. Literally. Exactly. With my body. I'm not armed with the radio. So uh, you will to give your life in defense of uh, true freedom? I am. I'll die for that man, you, her, and everybody that's watching this right now. The main reason we're doing this is not for cows, it's not for uh, land, it's not because that man owes money. He owes, he owes nothing. This is why we're doing this. It's the Constitution. And that's why I'm out here. It's, it's being trampled on. And uh, we got to stop it in some way. So if it takes me putting my body And that's what I'll do. Okay, pause it. For their privacy. So, um, you want to say hi to your family back home? Yes, especially my daughter and my son, Stephen and Paige Brooks. I love you, and um, I'm here for a good reason. What do you want to tell the rest of your family? Don't believe the silly stuff you're hearing. You know me, I'm a, I'm a level-minded individual. I wouldn't come all the way out here if it wasn't for a good reason. And I'm out here. I've seen it. These people are good people. They're Christians. They're hard-working men and women from all over the United States. And they're taking care of me. I'm actually getting fat. Everything that you're hearing that's negative is wrong. It's time to hear the positive. People are saying Cliven's a big, big rancher. You know, he don't have no big fancy home. He's a hard-working American just like anybody else. Worked hard all his life. He's got a big family. Uh, the way it used to be, people pull together. Morally, uh, and, and in other ways, you know, helping to helping each other along the way in life. Uh, they do have good, sound moral values. Uh, I don't think anybody could ever raise a question at, at all about the immorality of Clive and Bundy or anyone else in his family, or the locals out here that I've seen and spoke to. Fantastic people out here. Uh, I'm proud to have been a part of this. This is history, and, and we're we're in it. I'm proud to be here too, uh, and I'll stay until it's over. Thanks, Painter. I really appreciate you. I appreciate it. Thanks.